caught up and with my main man over here. So here's what's going on. I'm gonna, wait, I'm gonna put this over here. Let's put it right there. <laughs> so <laughs> Jasmine and I are gonna go to the library right now because it's midterms week. Thank you. That was so nice of you. Back away from the door, Grandma. Hello. Good morning. I'm in a peppy mood because I got like a pretty solid amount of sleep. Six whole hours. Yeah, it's Tuesday. So it's like nine or something. I gotta go to class at 10. I'm making coffee right now. I'm sure you can hear it. I have three classes. I don't know how much I'll film on there, but I have three classes today. And then I have work at six and I have a lot of homework I need to do in the meantime because it's midterms week. <laughs> the sizzling happened over here. I'm making some breakfast at 2 p.m. I'll try to talk over it. Hi, I just got back from class. I'm making some maple sausage with that paleo bread that I made last week in my last video. Go watch it if you haven't. And some eggs, so. Bad mood over, <laughs> good mood back. I have like a ton of reading I need to do before I go to work. I work at six and I have to do like a lot of homework before then, so I'm gonna do that. It's so cold. Hi everyone. It is like 7.30 something. I'm walking to my 8 a.m. class. I am so tired. I was at work super late last night. <sighs> I didn't go to bed until like two. Up at seven, so I'm tired. Yeah, I'm getting some Starbucks. p.m. I think. I went to go pick up Jasmine from the doctor and I just like decided to take my nap because I did plan on taking a nap so I took my nap and Jasmine was supposed to wake me up at 4 because she was taking a nap too but then her alarm didn't go off and my alarm didn't go off so next thing you know it's 6 30 p.m. and all the lights in the apartment go on she's like wake up and I'm like what day is it so uh, I'm wired right now I think the plan is I'm just gonna keep going back and forth and doing laundry and studying at the same time, but I don't think that'll be that difficult. <laughs> Wish me luck. Hey.
have my first class today until 10, but I have to go to office hours ahead of time for something else. I'm gonna spend the entire morning just like finishing studying and hoping for the best. <laughs> in an elevator. I am solid 30 minutes late for my <laughs> first class, but I just got out of office hours with one of my other professors for one of my other classes. So that's what's going on. <laughs> what up? I'm kind of peeved right now, I have to admit. I was up until 3.30 in the morning studying for this midterm that I just took. Now the test was like less than 20 questions long. It was 19 questions. It took me 12 minutes. I sacrificed so much time that I could have been studying for my other midterm that I have in like an hour, but uh, I was studying for this one and it was ridiculously easy. I mean, maybe it was easy because I was studying so hard for it, but I just feel like I put all my eggs in the wrong basket, if you know what I mean. So I'm gonna catch up on all the studying I didn't do last night because I have to now. What up, my peeps? Yeah, so I just finished that midterm. That's dope. It was definitely harder than I expected. He gave us eight possible prompts um, for essays. Of the eight, four would be on the midterm, and of the four, we only had to do two. And yet somehow all four of the ones that ended up on the midterm were the ones that I knew the least, which is always what happens. <laughs> but I think I did pretty okay. Yay, I just have work now tonight at six. Um, hi, it's like 1 p.m. right now, but I just woke up. It feels really good to sleep in this late. My friend Lorenzo and I were up until like 5 a.m. last night or like 4.30 or 4.45 or something. It was totally on accident. I didn't even get off work until midnight, but I got home. He came over, we watched the Han Solo Star Wars movie and it ended around like 3 a.m. He was gonna leave. He like, he put all of his stuff in his backpack he got up to leave and then somehow <laughs> we ended up talking about like futuristic technology and like the future of medicine, quantum computers. Like this conversation just cascaded and we ended up staying up until five o'clock in the morning talking about all kinds of stuff, <laughs> which is why it's 1 p.m. and I'm just now waking up, but. I'm doing good, how are you? Candy little girl. Let me pick a nice one for you. Just get a good one. You know what? I need just one because I know you're watching the wait. I'll have the other one. There you go. Oh Bing. my god, you are so oh, kind. Cheers. Cheers. Bing. Bing. <laughs> We are headed out right now to go to a couple parties because we're like super cool and we're like totally gauchos and we totally go to parties. First things first, we're taking some shots, so. Jasmine, get your ass over here. It's time for tequila. Ah. Hello. <laughs> I don't wanna go. You can do it, I swear. Put that tequila jacket on. What up, my party people? Jasmine totally fucking abandoned me. She left to take care of one of our other really drunk friends, forgetting about her current really drunk friend. I just bought a brownie and a cookie from the swim team for a fundraiser because they accepted Venmo. Well, isn't that a fucking tragedy? I just dropped my cookie and my brownie like seconds after 
vlogging about it. This is all I have left. <laughs> Hello! Hi, this is Becca, this is Hi, Miranda. Mm -hmm. I've known them since, well, I've known her since I was like. For, for a minute, for a, a minute. minute. And since high school for this yes. one. But Hello! I made her a scrapbook of our time at Disneyland once. It's your half shot, it's kind of a full cool one. Oh, love oh, that for me. Oh, And now he's blow drying them off in the bathroom. Wow. They lost. Oh. <laughs> I was like, hey, 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 I'm sorry if I'm talking weird, it's because I'm a little bit intoxicated. I'm sorry, I'm drunk and I'm being obnoxious. Okay, this is not a good time to vlog. I'm not being a good stand up citizen right now. Okay, look. Oh, oh no! I got some water. I'm trying to act sober, but I feel like I'm not doing it very well. The cool thing about UCSB is they care so much about our party culture that they have like people set out on DP with water just in case people need water like me. Hydrating, but what I really need is some pizza. I'm currently passing by my place of work, but they're closed. But hey guys, what's up? It's your girl. Tonight was so good. I haven't had like a good fun night like this in a long time. I got to hang out with Becca and Miranda. They were my friends from like high school. Miranda was my friend from like literally first grade. It was so fun. It was so fun. I never get to have fun like this. Hi. Hi. I'm very intoxicated right now. I gotta get that vlog content, you know? Oh. One of my roommate's friends blacked out on our couch. Hmm. I already cleaned up the bathroom though, so I am not intoxicated like Lauren, but um, she's been playing mom all night. You smell like a makeup wipe. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's what this little thing is. <laughs> I wonder why. going to bed I'm not proud of that by the way I hardly 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 ever get drunk enough to where I, I actually don't remember what happened like this is like maybe the third time in all my years that it's happened to me but I, I have no recollection of going to bed last night there's also makeup all over my shirt I only have one very vague memory of me in my bathroom puking and then getting up and opening the door and someone else being there like waiting to also go in there and puke and then maybe like oh yes go ahead <laughs> I feel like shit but that's just my own fault so I'm gonna end the vlog here uh, thanks for hanging out with me this week I will see you next time I vlog it might even be next week I don't know um, that's all I have to say thank you again for watching if you made it to the end you're the homie if you feel like it give this video a like and you know like subscribe too if you want I'm not gonna force you but that'd be pretty cool that's it drink responsibly and drink water also, I was informed by my roommate that last night when I got home, I ate a ton of her food. Like she ordered Chinese food and I ate like a ton of it. Then I force fed beans, cilantro, and then fell asleep on the ground while doing that. And then later got up, went to the bathroom. Apparently I was in there for an hour before my roommate came in and found me with my hair in the toilet and woke me up and told me that I should go to bed. But I don't remember any of that. Like I said, everybody, drink responsibly. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time, bye. <laughs>